Now the problem with doing a roundup video from a particular venue is that sometimes you just don't get that full trail vibe going. And so while I was sitting there going over the footage from Kohi de Brennan, I thought to myself, man, that's some baller trails. So this is a video of the top three, why I like them. So while I'm getting the formula rolling, this first trail is one called the Serpent's Tail. And it is one of those trails that just feels like a dang good day out on the bike. Trail works really nicely, scenery looks really good, the trail is visually oh, appealing nice as it is too. fun to ride. Not the most technical trail Goodbye. in the world, but Hop just one of those there. ones that gives you a proper good feeling while you run. Bit meandering, not so steep beautiful little trail. Oh, that works nicely. Looks really nicely. A little bit of feet grabbers here and there, but not bad at all. Not too shabby, Nigel. Not too shabby. Oh, Christoph, Darren, not so long now till we're cracking up a couple of ski of frosties together. Although I am going to bring something slightly better than a couple of Aneta Moolers. Now, the next trail is one of those ones that just really grabs the attention. The UK loves to do armor-plated descents and they do that to keep the trails pretty much all weather because it pisses down constantly and it is something that I very seldom get to ride. Lurch is one of those trails that just has a beautiful steep little beginning that's completely armor-plated and it is boy. That was really cool. Come on, Fulf. Ah, da beast, da beast. Now, filming in a trail center can be a proper ball lake sometimes. There's no clear indication about what is a descent and how long that descent is going to be. So we got off to a bit of a rocky start with filming of Abel. First, I got the camera going a little bit late. Then Stu came blowing Shred past me without realizing it was me. Saw my brother bottle it at a feature. So he stopped thinking I was in front of him, got himself all out of shape go it, go it. on a bit of a weird collapsed stair set. And uh, from there though, bumped it past Stu, got the ball rolling. And what was really nice about this trail was it was just a bit of, well, bumpy rocky substrate and a couple of nice little one, two, three step drops the whole way down. You can never go wrong with a good bunch of surprise stair sets mid-trail. It's one of my most favorite things to do. Huh? Yeah. Oh, okay. We'll stop, yep. Keep going. Okay, I'll wait for you at the next thing, yeah? Okay, I thought I could pedal it back on. This is again, proper nice little section of trail. Ooh. Came into that. Not like I probably would have liked to have come into that, to be honest.
top push. Whee! That was friggin' toitsicles. And that's that. Short and sweet little episode on just three of the, what I personally think are the highlight trails on the way around the beast at Koyi Jeprenen. And uh, I hope you guys enjoy that. I'll catch you when I catch you. <laughs>